Nine Wealth Creation Advice from Nine Billionaires Why are most people poor and how can you get rich? One of the simplest strategies to acquire wealth is to learn from people who have done so before. That's why Success Secrets TV brings to you nine wealth creation advice from nine of the richest people in the world. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you will miss other interesting videos like this. Number 1. Focus on Solving Problems Bill Gates In 2014, Gates told Rolling Stone in an interview, You know, development sometimes is viewed as a project in which you give people things and nothing much happens, which is perfectly valid. But if you just focus on that, then you also have to say that venture capital is pretty stupid too. Its hit rate is pathetic. But occasionally, you get successes. You fund a Google or something. Microsoft founder Bill Gates has built a reputation for being not only the richest man in the world for many years, but also one of the smartest and most serious thinkers alive today. So, it should come as no surprise that Gates got to where he is by focusing more on development and innovation and less on the business side of things. If you focus on improving and making things better, you end up being rich. Don't complain about problems. Get busy figuring out how to solve them and you'll create massive wealth for yourself. Number 2. Think Long Term Warren Buffett Self-made billionaire Warren Buffett believes in using long-term investment strategies. In fact, Buffett accumulated most of his impressive wealth after turning 50 and continues to make smart investments to this day, pulling off what Forbes called his biggest ever deal in August 2015. Buffett once said, Successful investing takes time, discipline and patience. No matter how great the talent or effort, some things just take time. You can't produce a baby in one month by getting nine women pregnant. Don't be in a hurry to be rich. Nothing happens overnight. Stay focused and determined. Think long term and keep on building. Number 3. Be a missionary to stay motivated. Jeff Bezos in a 2010 interview with Fortune, Bezos revealed that he thinks of business as a mission. I strongly believe that missionaries make better products, he said. They care more. For a missionary, it's not just about the business. There has to be a business and the business has to make sense. But that's not why you do it. You do it because you have something meaningful that motivates you. Amazon.com founder and CEO Jeff Bezos is a self-made billionaire who recently became the richest man in the world by being a missionary himself. While building a business, you need to see beyond the business itself. You must have a mission that's more important to you than the money. A mission to save the world. A mission to change the status quo. A mission that's bigger than you. Number 4. Think like a hacker Mac Zuckerberg Mark Zuckerberg was a sophomore at Harvard when he founded Facebook back in 2004. Since then, he's become one of the world's richest and most successful people. Zuckerberg attributes his success to a willingness to take risk and a desire to create something that can change the world. Additionally, he believes in following a business strategy known as the Hacker Way. In a 2012 letter to potential Facebook investors, he wrote, The Hacker Way is an approach to building that involves continuous improvement and iteration. Hackers believe that something can always be better and that nothing is ever complete. Number 5. Be aggressive with acquisitions Larry Ellison Net worth $40 billion Larry Ellison started his career building databases for the CIA before founding his own database software company, Oracle, in 1977. Over the years, Ellison has transformed from someone who despised growth acquisitions to someone who uses them to his advantage. 
Ellison's open-minded acquisition style, which helped Oracle acquire successful companies like PeopleSoft, Eloqua, and Sybil, enabled him to turn the organization into a giant that worth $187.6 billion. Moreover, Ellison has stressed the importance of having cash on hand for the next big acquisition. In a discussion with Wall Street Analyst, he said, We use our money for a variety of things. We buy back stock. We pay dividends. We haven't made any large acquisitions for a while, you know? We are kind of saving our nickels and dimes. We might do something interesting one of these days. Number 6. Focus on Consumer Tech Larry Page Larry Page and Sergey Brin co-founded Google in 1998. After Page created an algorithm called PageRank and used it to power the very first version of Google, then known as Backrub. Today, Page serves as CEO of Alphabet, Google's new publicly traded parent company. In an interview with the Financial Times, Page discussed the excitement and potential for great success when investing in today's tech industry. You can make an internet company with 10 people and it can have billions of users. It doesn't take much capital and it makes a lot of money. A really lot of money. So, it's natural for everyone to focus on those kinds of things. If you're just starting out in the business world, you may do better focusing on business-to-consumer model than business-to-business -business model. This is because consumer products usually have hundreds of thousands of potential customers as against B2B products which may have only few end users. Number 7. Never Stop Learning Michael Bloomberg During a 2013 episode of his weekly radio show, Michael Bloomberg said, I've never met a Nobel Prize winner who didn't think that they had an awful lot more to learn and wasn't studying every single day. So, when a parent says, How much does my kid have to learn before they can stop studying? I don't know how to break this to you, lady or sir. There is no answer to that. According to Bloomberg, the key to success is to keep learning new things every day. Almost every millionaire will tell you this. Why is daily learning important? Daily learning is very important for wealth creation because you can only be richer than most people in the world if you know what most people in the world don't. Number 8. Learn from Failure Carlos Slim Helu. In a 2010 speech at American University of Beirut, Slim gave his audience a valuable piece of advice. When we face our problems, they disappear. So, learn from failure and let success be the silent incentive. When most people fail, they stop trying. To be rich and successful, you must be able to try again and again despite several failures. Failures can make you smarter if you learn from them and try again. Number 9. Don't give up on idea Jack Ma Jack Ma attributes his success to never giving up on himself or his ideas. One of his most popular quotes is, If you don't give up, you still have a chance. If success is easy to get, everyone will have it. The road to success is tough and rough. Most people simply can't endure the journey. You have to be strong and stubborn if you really want to be successful. What we've learned so far 1. Focus on solving problems 2. Think long-term 3. Have a mission 4. Think like hackers 5. Focus on consumer products 6. Be aggressive in acquisition 7. Never stop learning 8. Learn from your failures 9. Don't give up on your idea You enjoyed this video, didn't you? We would like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe.
so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we handpicked for you to enjoy next. We love you.